his fourth song after this top five. Pop maker, take it away. Hooka. Put your hands together. Oh, thank you, ladies. Now I'll leave them off. Oh, man, good job. Right on, Donnie and Kiza are rocking it out there. All right, top five judges, go ahead and make your way out there. And you know, I want to also publicly acknowledge, you know, Donnie's adopted Hunka nephew. You know, he just ran over there. He's an FSIN vice chief, Craig McCollum from Canoe Lake. Let's give Craig a big round of applause. Yeah. Make your way over this way, gentlemen, if you get picked. Top five. And those dancers that don't make the top five, you come over here as well. The family's got something for you, too. Come over here, shake hands, come and see uh, Daisy, Shantae. Yeah. Yeah, Shantae. Come over here, uh, gentlemen, if you didn't make uh, the top five. You know, and as these dancers here, we're going to give them a break. We got one more song coming up. Top five will dance. Uh, down the line in the center. Top five, you come over here. Come and see, uh, come and see Daisy. <laughs> Ones that don't get picked, come and see Daisy. Our top five, make your way out there that got picked. You know, you're dancing for uh, first place. We'll receive $1,000, a frame championship photo, and a penalty. Second place will receive $800 and a penalty. Third place will receive $600 and a penalty. And all the other dancers will receive an uh, uh, honorarium. You know, as, uh, as we're doing here, we're getting ready uh, for our final song. You know, there's, uh, there's a lot of people... You know, I've seen and witnessed here my older brother and the work that he does and the work that he has done for many, many years. 
And he spent time working with uh, young people at risk. He spent time working in the inner cities of Saskatoon to inspire our people to get on this road of culture and language and song and dance. He's inspired many youth to, uh, to uh, find this road, to find this red road, this way of prayer. And I witnessed this in a good way. A young people will come up to him. They'll shake his hand. They'll acknowledge him. They'll say thank you. And it's all the work that he does from his heart in a good way to go out and get and share this. And this is a great way to honor him in this way. And us, as the uh, Ocheche Shakoi, it's our job to publicly honor and publicly do this. It's not something that he's asked for. It's not something that he's aspired to. It's something his daughters need to publicly do for each and every one of you. So ladies and gentlemen, if we can, let's please give him a big round of applause, Mr. Donnie Spidell. All right, we're going to ask here, the family's asked, all of our top five dancers, we want you to make a line right down the middle like this, facing the family, yep. Make a line facing the family, get enough room there. You're going to dance stationary where you are. So make sure you have enough room, spread yourselves out there. Yeah, make some room there. You're going to sta dance stationary where you are. This is our final song. This is our championship song. All right, you dancers here. You know, Donnie comes from a long line of fancy dance champions and a fancy dance legacy. You know, his, uh, his adopted father, his teacher, Sonny Larvey, was a, an amazing dancer. He was a spiritual person. He helped a lot of people, you know, through a healing journey and helped a lot of people. And he loved this dance that you guys are going to do, just like Donnie loves this dance that you're going to do. And he wants you to acknowledge that fancy war dance style. He wants you to acknowledge the footwork, the speed, and the beauty of it. And he wants you to think about our ancestors that shared this dance for all of us to be able to put these bustles on and dance the way that we dance right now. And we're going to ask all these dancers here to do this in the best way that they can. And this family here, they're going to look forward and they're going to pick their champions after this song. So ladies and gentlemen, this is our honor dance. This is our honor time. And it's our time to shine. Fancy dancers, you're going to rock it, man. And palm maker, you're going to sing a rocking tune. So here we go, boys. Sing it. Fancy dance, war dance style. Hookah. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give them a big round of applause. Uh, that is Tyler Thurman. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give them a big round of applause. Awesome job, Tyler. Holy smokes. 
Yeah, you're going to get this picture over here. Yeah, championship picture. You know, we want to acknowledge uh, Gary Gott, you know. Gary Gott, you know, Gary went and did this. And, you know, he did this here. And he wants to give that and offer that up. An original Gary Gott picture. Oh, man. Yeah. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, Red Deer, did you like that special? Let me know. Hey, awesome job. Oh, man. We're going to call for Pat and Marissa. We want to acknowledge these dancers here. Kaysen Street, Tommy Draper, Navarone Thunderchild, Amos Yazi the Three, and Tyler Thurman. Ladies and gentlemen, those are our champions. hook -ah. We're going to call forward Pat and Marissa. The family wants you to come down here. They got a gift for you. Allowing us here to take some time. And uh, they also want to ask George Desirely to lay on this buffalo robe. <laughs> As we go forward here. You know, this buffalo way, this way of life and this ceremony. You know, uh, Donnie Spadell, he knows the spirit of this uh, uh, Tatanka, you know, and the spirit of what this is. It was gifted to him, you know, this way of life and the society dance. And there's many blessings that go with it. And at this time, he wants to wrap up uh, Marissa and Patrick for all that they did here for the city of Red Deer, for allowing his family to do this at this time. Hey, ha, uh, hey. We're going to call forward here this drum group from the 345. We're going to call up Poundmaker. You know, send a representative up here. The family wants to see you. Uh -huh. uh, it's such a good thing, you know, those buffalo robes. And those of you that don't know, you know, this... Uh, this guy here, Clyde Tatusis, you know, he's a lead singer of Poundmaker Singers, you know, uh, started that drum up and wanted to bring back his uncle's way. Hook! -ah! And we have a whistle, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to call forward all of our dancers. It is time to rock and roll. We're going to call forward this Blackstone.
Thank you very much there. Our whistle carrier, Mr. Donnie Spidell, and Blackstone for honoring that whistle right there. We're gonna go over here to Mr. Hal Eagletail to get us some judges for our Golden Age and Men's Buckskin categories. All right, thank you. Mr. Action Jackson, Tahuka out of Orange County, California, IA. Claude Friday, Nicole Ishkagogan, Nugget Bull Bear, Dwayne Wesley, AJ Braun, Kyla Old Elk. Dance judges, come on in. We're gonna go in reverse order in our dance contest. We're gonna start over at Kehio Asini. Buffalo Robe, stand by. You'll have the women's, women's Golden Age traditional. Bad War Cloud, you'll be singing for the Women's Golden Age Fancy Jingle Combined. Young Spirit, be ready for the Men's Golden Age traditional. Lazy Dog, you'll have the men's golden age, fancy grass, prairie chicken combined. We're going to go through our golden age at this time, and we're going to ask our dance judges to come forward. Claude Friday, Nicole Eshkagogan, Nugget Bull Bear, Kyle Old Elk, Dwayne Wesley, A.J. Braun. Come on in. Want to make a quick shout out to... Cal Crazy Legs Arcan, our roaming MC. Let's give our MC Cal Arcan that's doing our live feed for our powwow a round of applause. Crazy Legs in the house. Good to see you, brother. Good to see you. Nice to see my brother from another mother, Cal. Cal, I was told not to be telling any uh, Thanksgiving jokes because we all are stuffed. So I can't quit cold turkey. Oh, yeah. All right, round them up there, dance judges. We're going to go into our contest dancing. We're going to go back to back in our singing, and we're going to start judging our singing when we get to Sorrel Rider. Sorrel Rider, you'll start off our singing contest in our dancing song styles. Probably get to our juniors or possibly teens by then. We're going to go to the semifinals right away in our junior and teen categories here tonight. Semifinals. Tomorrow afternoon, we're going to have finals for all of our junior and teen categories. Two song night tomorrow, two song afternoon. Tomorrow, you'll have your finals right away there, young ones. All right, we got the high sign. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to get rocking. Take it away. Cahillo and Sydney. Contest on the floor. Our war bonnet dancers, men's buckskin. <laughs>
All right, beautiful stars, warriors, let's line them up. Come on in, dance judges. We're going to ask our next set of dance judges to make their way on in. Vaughn Daniels, Howard Adams, Ori Little Sky, Nadine Obi, Cameron Kutney, Eddie Wolfchild. Uh, we're going to ask you to come on in. All of our dance judges, we have uh, chairs at the other end of the arbor for you. So we're going to rotate you back and forth here. So we have 12 registered right, no, dance no, judges to help us out in this first go round. Once again, Claude Friday, Nicole Eshkogogin. Test, Nicole test, Nugget test one, two. There. Dwayne Wesley, AJ Braun, Vaughn Daniels, Howard Adams, Ori Little Ah, we're here with my good friend and relative, Mr. Donnie Spidell, a beautiful special Donnie. You know, a lot of the viewers don't know that you were one of my teachers beginning of my power journey and uh, with a lot of thoughts going through my mind as they honored you. But getting back to yourself, what does it mean to you being honored like that by your fellow fancy dancers? Uh, just, it's a, a, a generational um, uh, honoring to um, all the older generation, to all of us, you know, uh, my, my uh, fancy dancers before us, you know, the, the way that they were, and we try to carry on, you know, some of those good qualities that those elder gentlemen uh, taught us about and uh, how to care for ourselves, care for our family, how to represent our tribe and our nation, and then, uh, you know, try to uh, represent this, this, this warrior circle here, so. You betcha. You know, I see guys like Tommy Draper out there, they carry on that fancy dance through generations. I kind of moved on to grass. I know you dance fancy. Most of your, your dance, uh, I guess, career, for lack of a better word, but also now the buffalo rope dance. Yes. Uh, always, uh, fancy dance will always be my first love, and I uh, enjoyed it ever since I was three years old. And, um, you know, now uh, just the uh, knees and the body just, just uh, doesn't keep up with me. But my mind and my heart is still there. But uh, but I still uh, still honor my dad uh, with this uh, Tatuta Kipa, you know, this, this, uh, this uh, dance for healing and, and, and uh, prosperity you know, for our nation. Donnie Spidell, Buffalo boy, Tatanka Hoxilla, thank you for honoring us with your style of dance. Thank you for educating the kids and the people. Hi, hi.
beautiful, graceful styles. Grandmothers, come on over here. Come and see Rusty. He's got the lineup over there with where George is on the other side. We're going to call upon the Women's Golden Age. Fancy and Jingle combined. Women's Golden Age, Fancy and Jingle combined. Once again, we'd like to ask you to please rise, those that can, to honor our beautiful grandmothers. They're showing us in their Golden Age that you can still enjoy life, keep active, and stay fit, and rock this joint. And those are the beautiful examples of our givers of life. So if you'd like to rise for our grandmothers here in our fancy and jingle combined, you're welcome to do so. Honoring our grandmothers, we got the high sign. We're going to go to the sounds of Bad War Cloud. Let's get away. Contest on the floor. Bad War Cloud. You like that power of fans? Ah, ha, ha. Beautiful dance styles, our givers of life, our women's golden age, fancy and jingle combined. I'd like to acknowledge those that stood up to honor our beautiful women, those that did not stand up. Be careful, those are the type that'll put you in the old folks' home. All right, we're going to bring in our men's golden age, traditional. Stand by, Men's Golden Age, Fancy Grass Prairie Chicken Combined. Young uh, Spirit, we're going to go to your style for the Men's Golden Age Traditional. Dance judges, circle up so Rusty and uh, George can identify you. I'd like to have... Uh, Acknowledge all of our dance judges for helping us out, differentiating between these awesome dance styles. This is a traditional. So Prairie Chicken can choose whether they want to dance in the traditional category or the fancy grass category. It's up to you, Prairie Chicken dancers. It's up to you. Leave it at, at your discretion. Hey, we got the high sign. Let's get rocking, young spirit. Contest on the floor, men's golden age, traditional prairie chicken dancers.
Hey, Red Deer, awesome. we've got a special Peter's guest here. You talk about our Indigenous heroes and uh, some of our role models. we got Eric Bearspaw here from the Eden Valley, Alberta. Big oh. traditional special happening uh, in your honor, $25,000. Uh, tell us a little bit about it. Well, uh, I've, been, I've been really like, we've been getting this put together for, this is going to be the fourth year, the final okay. year for my late father, Floyd Bearspaw. You know, I got to tell you that that guy's really a good, honestly, humble man in my eyes, like what I do. You betcha. You know, it's like, the thing is that, you know, to, uh, to share my emotions while I'm doing this memorial for him, because the that, that belt, first, before we do that, I talk about the belt, because the belt, before I wasn't in this earth, he was a boxer champion back in his primes. Yep. And, you know, I want to honor that. For those that, that don't know as well, Eric here, they call him Wee Man on the power circuit, also a wrestler, and you can find him, some of his stuff on the Micro Wrestling Federation. Yep. So check it out on uh, YouTube. He's having a, a big special. There he is, carrying the belt. They've donated a belt here in honor to help out the special. Longtime traditional dancer. And he has uh, one more thing to note there. He also beat me in a grass special back in Prince Albert. Eric Bearspaw, thanks for doing this, Eric. Yeah. Good luck with the special. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you there, Lazy Dog. Junior boys, Prairie Chicken, make your way out there. Junior dance judges, come on in. Caius Bullbear, Julia Whiteman, Carrie Crowchild, Cheryl Croce, Nina Cattleman, Gina Daniels, Michaela Hunt, Hutch, Sitting Eagle Jr., Charles Fable, Uriah Zortier, <laughs> Patsy Grant. We have Carrie Crowchild twice here. Darren, we had an alternate judge. Oh, we got the high sign. Black Stud. Let's light them up, boys. Let's light them up. Contest, <laughs> the semifinals, junior categories. <laughs>
them up with your appreciation, Powwow fans. Thank you, they're black. Hey, everybody. We have some uh, visiting leadership from uh, Saskatchewan here. Chief Tanya Stone from the Mosquito Grizzly Bear said, Lean Man First Nation. How are you doing, Chief? Really good. So your first time to the international celebration here in Red Deer. What made you want to come out? Well, um, Donnie's a special, and uh, he told me this morning that he was having this special because it's his birthday, happy birthday, and uh, just made it in time. So I watched it all. It was beautiful. I was telling Chief Tanya there, you know, Donnie, when I was 10 years old, he was the one that uh, started teaching me fancy. She didn't believe me I was a fancy dancer. She thought I was just trying to be with the cool kids. Yeah, but yeah. Yeah, and then his birthday is on the 21st. He turned 50, and I turned 49 on the 20th. Wow. Yeah, we're Virgos. Yeah. Yes, well, I'm right glad on. you got to join in there. And big shout out to your community. I know you guys have a big celebration out there as well. When is your powwow? Uh, our powwow is usually in, in the summertime. Okay, yeah, yeah. but what month? Uh, well, give, give us a ballpark so the, the viewers. July, August, you know, actually, I was just talking to our powwow president, Judy. She's here. And I said, what a great opportunity to make all your connections here. You betcha. And so um, I know she's uh, and the committee, they're all in the, you know, in the works of creating uh, and in making those invitations and doing all the protocol. Yeah, so we also have Michelle Daniels here. She's also part of the POW committee and, uh, and some of our own membership that right are dancing. On. Chief Tanya Stone, Mosquito Grizzly Bears Head Lean Man, checking out the international celebration here in Red Deer. Thank you, Chief. Thanks. Yeah, no.
home there. Put your hands together for our junior girls, traditional, and our contest drummers over there. Southern Medicine, right on for your contest. Go around with our head singing drum, Napisis. Paul Partridge, you're asked to see Mr. Steve Wood, our head singing judge. Please and thank you. All you singing judges go over there to Sorrell Ryder. Sorrell Ryder, you're going to have the contest for the junior boys. Traditional. Come on out there, junior boys. Traditional. This will be your contest. Going to you will be Sorrell Ryder for your contest song. First call, junior boys. Traditional. Stand by, junior girls. Jingle, you're on next. Junior girls, jingle. All of our singing judges move on down to Sorrell Ryder. We got just qua. We almost got the highest sign. Uncle, you got your judges. Let me know. You know, all of our powwow relatives and family, we got some good days ahead of us, so some powwow, good love, good energy. Ready to boot, scoot, and boogie. Let's go down here to the next category. Third and final call for the junior boys traditional. Third and final call. We're missing one judge, not B. Sisji. Paul Partridge, Simak, go to the drum judging group of Sorrel Ryder, not B. Sis. Simak. All righty, once again, we got these judges coming on down. Let me know whenever we're good to go. Napisis Niti across Sorel Riders. Amagayu. Holding the power up. Right on. <laughs> Our relations from Makasagayigan. Tap women. Awi na. Napisis. Okay. We got our drum judges. We got all of our junior boys traditional. We're going to the contest song. Sorrel Ryder, you're on the air. Junior boys traditional contest. Here we go. Your hands together for our junior boys, traditional and Sorrel Rider singers for your contest song. Right on there, right on there, singers. We're moving on down the line to the next drum group in line, which is Crazy Creek. All you junior girls, jingle. Come on out, junior girls, jingle. We're going to have two groups, I do believe. 
So once our arena directors, Rusty Gillette, George Tesserle are going to get you counted out. I do believe we might go two, and two groups for this specific category. So stand on by. Crazy Creek. Crazy Creek. You are on standby here. You know, all your powwow family that are sitting in the stands, we have a lot of dancers. I haven't got the head count just yet, but I'll call over here to our CNT tabulations, and maybe they'll get us a good head count of how many dancers we have here for our celebration. So all you junior categories, if you're a group one, you're on the arena floor. Group two, take a step back. Be on standby. We have 714 dancers here at Red Deer International. Let's give them all a round of applause. 714 dancers right on, right on. Okay, Junior Girls Jingle, first group. You're going to want a crazy creep for that song. Here we go. Nigga Buck Boy Suck Crazy Creep Contest. <laughs> your hands together there for the group number one and the junior girls jingle right on there to crazy creek singers for that contest song real quick we have some teen judges we want to be prepared leroy mcginnis julianne debray tanya roan shirley hill marcy two guns alana trudeau and also Celeste Tusis, Mariah Dumont, Dallas Powderface, Maximus Chica, Claire Butterfly, and Luke Whiteman. For our teen judges, be on standby here this evening. Tonight, you are the Friday Night Light judges, so be on standby. Teen categories, come on out. Group number two, T or Junior Girls Jingle. Group number two, your song will be coming to you from Chinakee Lake. We're good. We got the high sign. Contest is on. Shinnecke Lake. Here we go.
boys, for that group number two. Here we go. And our go ahead, Cal, lead it, eh? Hey everybody, we got James Joan, Notorious Cree, Indigenous content creator, TikTok sensation. Tell us a little bit about your success. Um, honestly, it just started with TikTok like during the pandemic when everyone was at home watching uh, Netflix eating cheesy poofs. Yeah, I, uh, yeah. was bored. I just started posting some content, like more kind of dance, like, uh, like traditional dance videos on there. And then, yeah, it just kind of blew up and kind of started uh, snowballing from kind there. Kind of motivated you to do more. And yeah, well, I was like, I was really missing, like just putting on my regalia and dancing. And um, I just really was like, I wanted to find a space so I could just express myself and like just share some some cool videos and stuff like that. And yeah, it was a it was a good excuse to put my stuff on and practice. Where are you from originally? Uh, I'm from Tulkri First Nations, so uh, Treaty Eight territory. Yep. Okay. So they follow you on Notorious Cree? Yeah, on uh, TikTok and Instagram, Facebook. Yeah. Huge, this guy. You know what's good? I like your content, man. It's consistent. It's always, you know, even though you're changing up a little bit, but you're always telling the stories. You know, we we're talking about reconciliation. You know what you're doing with your stuff. You're telling the history and your dance. I love how it's just consistent and keeping on and still getting the viewers in. Uh, a lot of people actually. I think I just looked at it. I think it was like 4.1 million. He just yeah. took a picture with me and Cal. We just added another million followers for him. <laughs> yeah. So what, uh, <laughs> are you sticking solely to TikTok or do you do some youth events and some gatherings? Or No, I think like, you know, that's the thing is before like before I was doing any social media stuff, um, I did a lot of like youth, youth work and community work. And I'm still doing that like as much as I can. So I still do a lot of work with communities. I still do a lot of youth work, um, like teaching uh, dance classes, stuff like that. So if people want to like, get a hold of you, what do, who do they call? How do they contact? Uh, you can just, um, on, on pretty much any one of my social medias, I usually have my booking information. And But it's just NotoriousCree at gmail.com. There you have That's it, folks. Easiest. Notorious Cree, James Jones. Thanks for hey, doing this, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Awesome, man. Thanks, guys. Yeah. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Stay deadly. Let's cheer on our junior boys, grass dancers! together make some thunder for our junior boys grass dancers right on their thunder league on that song all right hey let's get a picture of this young girl over here cameraman cameraman right up here on the stage get a picture of this young lady she's lost let's stand her up here let's stand up here come on stand up 
Claude Friday, we got your daughter up here. Look right there. See that? Awesome. See that? Wave at the camera. Wave and look up there. See you. See yourself? There you are. All right, we got this young girl. Let's make a big round of applause for this young lady. She officially made this a powwow. Our first lost child. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's mom right behind you. Look behind you. There you go. <laughs> That's how we do it. Thank you, cameraman. Oh, awesome. thank you. Thank you very much there, camera guy. If you're watching on the intercom, you know that you're on the powwow times. Good time vibes. Here we go. We're going to go down to the next drum group in line, which will be Bullhorn. Come on out there, junior girls. Fancy shawl. You're going to get this song on the Friday Night Lights right here once I get the high sign from Steve Wood, our head singing judge. We are good to go. Nigga muck. Bullhorn Contest! for our junior girls, Fancy Shaw and Bull Horn for that awesome contest song there for the inter, I would say, our contest drumming. We're gonna go on down the line here to the next drum group in line. Pound Maker, move on over there. Singing judges to Pound Maker. Real quick announcement, teen judges, be ready. Leroy McGinnis, Julianne Debray, Tanya Roan, Shirley Hill, Marcy Two Guns, Alana Trudeau, Celeste Tussis, Mariah Dumont, Dallas Powderface, Maximus Sheikah, Claire Butterfly, and Luke Whiteman. Okay, moving on down the line to the next jump group in order, all the way from Pound Maker, Saskatchewan. Pound Maker Contest. Here we go.
Girls Fancy Shawl. Thank you very much, there, singers of Pound Maker. Right on to all of our competing drums here. We have our judges from all over Turtle Island. And guess what? They're making it fair and square. They're making it good. They're making it right. They're making it proud and loud. Here we go to the next drum in line. Black. Foot Confederacy, once we get the high sign from our head singing judge, our arena director, Rusty Gillette, and George Desiree, we'll move on forward to the junior boys. Fancy first and second call to the junior boys. Fancy, come on out here. Here we go. As we're live action, we're moving on down here to you know who, Blackfoot Confederacy Contest. <laughs> song to some rock and dancing. Line them up, young warriors, teen boys, prairie chicken dancers. Make your way on the floor. Dance judges, you know who you are. All righty, here to our teen category. Judges, we're going to ask Leroy McGinnis, Julianne Debray, Tanya Roan, Shirley Hill, Marcy Two Guns, Alana Trudeau, Celeste Tusis, Mariah Dumont, Dallas Powderface, Claire Butterfly, Maxima Mashika, and Luke White. Man, you are on here for our Teen Boys Chicken. First call, Teen Boys Chicken. Second call to our Teen Boys Chicken. We're going on down the line to the next category and next drum group nakota nation you are on the air nakota nation contest <laughs>
traditional, stand by. Team boys, traditional, stand by. How do you like that there, Red Deer? How do you like that Teen Boys Chicken right on there, gentlemen? Grab yourselves a good real estate to get judged up from our judges and sent on over here to CNT Tabulations. We're going to be now calling on over here to the next group, Junior Girls Traditional. I'm sorry, Teen Girls Traditional. Come on up. We're gonna go with our team boys first. Team boys, traditional, come on through. Team boys, traditional, team boys, grass, team boys, fancy in that order. Right on there, gentlemen. And after that, to our team girls, categories, team girls, traditional, jingle, and fancy in that order. Okay, our next drum group in land will be Mountain Cree. I do believe we have a lot in this category. We'll let you know if it's one group or two groups here. You know, a lot of our relatives come from far and wide to make sure they enjoy the powwow. If there's anything that we could do to make it better, you let us know on our Red Deer website and let us know how we can improve our powwow at best. All right, here we go. To the next category in line, we got our Teen Boys Traditional. Here we go. Mountain Cree. Nick up my boy, son.
Oh, let's show some support for our Teen Boys Traditional. And as a result, during this contest, all you Teen Boys Traditional, you are being judged for the Camden Scribe Honor Special. We have our judges present, and we are giving you some points. And we're going to tally it up tomorrow on our second round and go to the top ten. As a result, all right, you guys, we're back here again. Here I got Bach Garcia from Tohono O'odham Tribe here from uh, Orange County, California. We're gonna get right to it. He's got a cool story about these shoes. So these shoes are from the Nike SB slash Born and Raised. Uh, a man named Sponto, he was the creator of Born and Raised. Unfortunately, he passed away, but before he passed away, he did a collaboration with Nike SB. And these shoes that you see here, they're all really authentic. And here it says, one block at a time. Uh, my friend Kenneth Shirley uh, from Indigenous Enterprise invited me and my sister out to Venice Beach to perform and we did a little video shoot and this video shoot was able to pretty much wear our outfits and Nike told us for the video shoot that we were supposed to do is that we we're supposed to wear these shoes in honor of Sponto that originally passed away. So we did a video shoot in Venice Beach and the shoes honestly look really, really amazing and we were the first ones to wear them until they were recently released in the U.S. Uh, I believe they should be released out sometime in Canada and worldwide. Nice, uh, so really quick man, what's it like to be shooting commercial with Nike? Um, shooting a commercial with Nike, honestly, it honestly, it's, 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 a, it's an honoring, um, but especially doing it with Born and Raised, it's a huge honoring because I've known Sponto since, um, well, he's actually been in part of my life since I was a little kid, but I didn't meet him till I grew, I, until I grew up. Because I lived in Orange County, and he lived in L.A., and he knew my family originally, and you know, we all came together. And then I've known Indigenous Enterprise since I was young. And you know, being a part of Nike and Born and Raised is a huge honor. Awesome. Is this your first time at the Powwow? Uh, this is my second time. Uh, Were you here last year? Yeah, I was yeah, here last nice, year. Yeah, nice, man. So what do you think of the vibe this year? I like it. It's a lot bigger than last yeah. year, but um, yeah, I'm pretty much the first ones. Well, not the first ones, but maybe the third people to wear them in here in Canada. So these are coming out right away. Uh, should be. They should be coming out soon in Canada, but I already know they released in the U.S. Yeah, nice so, yeah. man. These are these are the shoe of the year. Yeah, the these are the nice. Year. Look at that. It's even got some designs in the back there, if you can see. Really good thing. So, really quick, man, I want to uh, thank you for coming on here. And remember, we're here all working. Is there anything you want to uh, say really quick to uh, anybody? I just want to shout out. I just want to give a shout out to my mom, uh, Garden Grove area, my sister, and my family. And uh, shout out to Born and Raised and Nike. You know, awesome, we bro. miss you, Sponto. Right on, brother. All right, thank you, man. We're going to head back now to the floor. Steve Wood. Our arena director says we're good to go. Here we go. Pipe stem creek. Teen girls traditional. Teen Girls Jingle, stand by. Teen Girls Jingle, stand by.
to our Teen Girls Traditional. I know we said Teen Boys Grass Dance, but we're gonna move to Teen Girls Jingle to come on out, Teen Girls Jingle. We're gonna go back in the swing of things and back in the order right here. Thank you very much to Pipe Stem Creek for that song. Creek Confederation, Jum Judges, move on over down to Creek Confederation as we move forward for our Teen Girls Jingle. Now, I do believe Teen Girls Jingle will have two groups Two groups in this category. Uh, Jackson, just hold on real quick. We have a lost child up here. He's on the left-hand side here, folks. Uh, uh, he said that his, na his dad's name is Claude Friday. Claude Friday, come get your son up here. <laughs> Friday you, the 13th, this lost baby. <laughs> yes. Can you, uh, hey, this one right here, get, get him. <laughs> Get him on cam there. <laughs> that, this one here, he's lost. <laughs> Claude Friday is his dad. Uh, Claude Friday is his uncle dad. <laughs> well, I don't know which one's darker, him or his child. <laughs> I don't know. He's, I think he's too handsome to be uh, Claude's son. Uh -huh. He was also born on a Friday. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we have two groups in the Teen Girls Jingle. Two groups. If you are asked, group one, stay on the floor. Group two, you're going to be on next. First song will be Creek Confederation for the first group. Second group will have Battling Sue. Okay. Our drum judges are good. Dance judges are good. Here we go, Teen Girls Jingle Creek Confederation Contest. Put your hands together for the Teen Girls Jingle. First group right on Creek Confederation for that song. We're going to move on down over here to Battling Sue for the next song. Or oh, I'm sorry. Sorry about that. We're going to go to Kahil Asani. Drum judges to Kahil Asani for the next song. And the group two, Teen Girls Jingle. 
Come on out, group two, teen girls jingle, as we go on down to the next group in line, which is going to be Eagle Rock Kahil Usani. For all your relations out there, we want you to tell you to have some good love and good energy. When you see someone dancing hard, support them with that good energy. Let's go on down to the group two, teen girls jingle. Here we go, Kahil Usani, you're on the air contest. Put your hands together and support these young relatives. Our teen girls jingle group number two. Thank you very much there, Kihil Asani. We're moving on down to the next category in line, which is going to be our teen boys grass dancers. Come on out, teen boys grass dancers. You're going to get a song from Battling Sue. Battling Sue, all you drum judges, move on down the line with Steve Wood, our head singing judge, to go over here to Battling Sue. Second call to our Teen Boys Grass dancers. Teen Boys Grass, where are you gentlemen? Teen Boys Grass, this will be your first, second, and final call. You got yourself the high sign. Here we go, Battling Sue contest. Here we go.
Now put your hands together there for our teen boys. Grass dancers right on there, gentlemen. We are now calling over here. Good song there to Battling Sue. Thank you for coming out there, gentlemen. Teen Girls Fancy Shawl. We're going to have two groups in Teen Girls Fancy Shawl. So with that being said, we're going over down to the next drum in line, which will be... Buffalo Robe. Buffalo Robe, you will have the first group in our teen girls fancy shawl. These are the up and coming, all the young ladies here that are here to dance for the people, to dance for their families, and to have some good times with powwow times right here in Red Deer, Alberta. For all the ones that are out there spectating, I hope you're enjoying yourselves. It might be getting crazy, might be getting warm, might be getting nice and warm in this area, but that's for a good reason because we are in celebration. Alrighty here, we have two groups. First group, Buffalo Robe, you're on the air contest. Here we go. Put your hands together for the teen girls fancy shawl. First group, second group, come on out right on their buffalo robe for that contest song. All right, on good luck in our singing contest. Moving on down to Bad War Cloud right next door for that second group in our teen girls fancy shawl. Second. Call for the Teen Girls Fancy Shawls, group number two. Be on standby, Teen Boys Fancy. Teen Boys Fancy, you're on next, so be on standby. Here we go. We got the high sign from the arena director. Let's move on down to Bad War Cloud. Here we go. Contest.
Fancy Shaw, group number two. Here Thank you very uh, much there. The Bad grandfather, War the Blackstone Singers, Sweet Grass, Terry Paskman. Terry, thank you for doing this. Tell us a little bit about uh, your family and uh, you know singing with your sons and your grandsons. Back in uh, 1983, I first started singing at Powell. I started out with uh, Sweet Grass Singers there, my big brothers, Alvin, and then my cousins there. And by, by, 20, by 1987, I started my own group, and uh, I, I always talk about it with my young, my my sons, my singers, saying that like I never could have imagined how, it, how it's been for the past 35 and then uh, five, 35 plus years. And I never intended on that. I just wanted to be able to sing at a drum solo. So I try to pass that on to my sons. So I always try to tell them. Uh, don't ever take things for granted. That's how you you get that 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 same innocence, that same uh, humility. When I first started out, that's what I try to continue to this day. Terry Passman, Blackstone Singers, World Class Drum Group. Thank you for doing this, Terry. Hi, hi. Here we go, Team Boys Fancy. You got yourself a young spirit. Here we go. Here we go. for the Teen Boys Fancy right on their Young Spirit for your contest song. Thank you very much. We're moving on down the line to the Senior Adult Categories. All Senior Adult Categories, you're gonna be brought into you from Mr. Donnie Spidell. Where you at there, brother? Where you at there, Koda? Hey, thank you. Um, good to be here this evening. Singing your men's chicken. Come on out, it's your contest time. Uh, Rusty, we're going with one song, two songs. It's a one-song night. All right, we're over here. Uh, the following judges, we're going to need you on over this way. We need um, Marlon, Marilyn, Contoves, Jeff Downing, Melinda Goodwill, Lexi Whiteman, also uh, Hutch, Sitting Eagle, Tira Snow, Karen Pheasant, Tommy Draper, Calvert Wolf, Child Senior and Roger Hunt Jr. And then also uh, Dean Littleton and Wakia Luke oh, Luke Whiteman once again. All right, thank you. We're going to get our singing judges on over here. We're over here at Lazy Dog. Lazy Dog, stand by for the contest song. Senior Man's Chicken, we want to say thank you to each and every one of your championship dancers. We're making our way out here this weekend to Red Deer, Alberta. We just about got the go sign. We're going to put the green and go. And we're going to turn it on over here to south of the medicine line. Ladies and gentlemen, one of our premier up-and-coming drum groups going by the name of Lazy Dog. Holy smokes. And I want to say a quick shout-out here to some of my friends from the... Uh, uh, Mosquito First Nation over in Treaty 6, Treaty 4 Territory over in Saskatchewan, Chief Tanya Stone, and also uh, her uh, co-pilot, Judy. I want to say good evening over here. All right, good to see you. Some of the relatives over there. We're set to go. It's contest time. It's a Friday night. We're turning on over here to Lazy Dog. It's contest time. 
Let's get them going. Mika. Say, ladies and gentlemen, right there, put your hands together right here, ladies and gentlemen. Senior men's chicken, thank you, lazy dog. Also, thank you to our head man dancer, Mr. Kesson Thompson, for coming out and hanging around here. And I was like, man, that young guy, he grew up quick. <laughs> he grew up quick, but uh, he's out there. We're going to get our senior woman's traditional to come on out. We're going to be going in the uh, senior adult lineup here at Senior Women's Traditional, Senior Men's Traditional, Senior Women's Jingle, Senior Men's Grass, Senior Women's Fancy, and Senior Men's Fancy. You'll be the uh, grand finale in our senior adult division. We're going to ask our singing judges to head on over here, circle up around Blackstone, and they're going to take us through one wicked song here tonight. It's a one-song contest night, Senior Adult, so... Be near, be around, stay close to the arena. We got it. We're ready to go. Blackstone contest time. Here we go. Pick <laughs>
about a big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. That was their first contest go around. Thank you to our senior women's traditional for taking some time to be here in Red Deer, Alberta, 2023. We're going to get our senior men's traditional, our senior men's northern traditional to come on out. Also, uh, we may have some of our, uh, our southern brothers here with us also, some of our southern style. But in the meantime, right here, we're going to be moving on over here, uh, singing judges to... Uh, Southern Medicine. Southern Medicine have the next contest song ready to go. We're kind of on the move here. It's about 10.56 on opening day. And it's sounding good, feeling good, feeling right. We hope all of you uh, powwow fans are enjoying yourself here at the Red Deer powwow times. This is a, an awesome powwow experience. And, um, you know, the organization here, they really wanted to... Uh, bring about a little bit of a different flavor. They wanted to bring about something that was uh, entertaining, something that was, uh, you know, enjoyable, something that all generations of people could enjoy, and it certainly is that. This is group number one for Senior Men's Traditional. We got the go sign. Here we go. Southern Medicine, you're on the air. Let's get them dancing. hook a hook a a big round of applause ladies and gentlemen that was group number one thank you southern medicine good song good song sorrow riders stand by as we bring forward group number two of the senior men's traditional dance division come on out warriors come on out gentlemen and stand by right after our second group of the men's traditional senior men's uh, groups we're going to be coming right into the uh, senior woman's jingle be standing ready we got the go. Let's turn them free. Sorrel Rider, you're on the air. Hookah. Hookah.
have it, ladies and gentlemen. Outstanding performance here. Group number two, make your way Hey, guys. We're back here. We got council member Kendall Jacobs from the Satina Nation. Yeah. We just kind of ran into him here. So thank you for coming to the power. How are you enjoying it? It's uh, it's nice. My daughter's dancing jingle. She started dancing this year, and uh, she's been hitting a powwow, a few powwows, and brought it up to this local powwow. And it's nice. It's really, it's really good rocking. atmosphere, good energy, eh? <laughs> yeah. Well, he it's pretty was walking rocking. by there here in the back here with me and Cal <laughs> visiting. So we want to know what's going on here. What's which, oh, uh, the wolf! This, I've been looking for. I've been looking for. This is Mazina in my language. Okay. Mazina, Mazina, yeah. yeah, Mazina, and um, in our people, well, in all plains culture, we would use. We learned a lot of hunting techniques from Mazina. We saw Mazina, yeah. our grandfather, the wolf, and so a lot of the time it was. Um, we would use it to hunt the buffalo. We even observe him how he hunts the buffalo, stuff yeah. like that. Put them in and disguise, yeah, put right? Put them in and disguise. Get them close and could shoot them and even lure them to the jump. These would be kind of behind the buffalo while they would pressure and they'd have uh, buffalo calf runners. Yeah. They would be in the front and kind of lure them closer to the yeah. buffalo jump. But um, what I'm going to do with this, I've been looking for Mazina for a long time. Um, what I was going to do with it is I'm going to cut him open right here because he's not open right here yet, but I'm going to make a hunting robe. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Basically like that. There it is, guys. You're getting a first-hand sight here, Councilor yeah. Jacobs. So it's going to be like, yeah, it's going to be a, the hunting rope yep. that I use to teach our kids about the old yeah, ways. Let's yep. pull it over here. Pretty cool. He's uh, coming back to the dancing circle, folks. He danced <laughs> in his younger years, 12 years yeah. old. We were talking about it earlier, you yeah, know. Yeah. Not not that coming back, but also at any age, we can yeah. join. It's just our, our dance, our culture to share with that. So thank yeah, you for being here, yeah, Councilor. Definitely. Thank you for sharing. Thank you, sir. Thanks for having me. Hey, hey, hey. Satina Nation. Satina Nation, yeah. Sutin. Right on. Let them hear it, ladies and gentlemen. How about a nice round of applause here? First contest go around. Thank you, Senior Woman's Jingo. Thank you to the singers. Chinnakee Lake, stand by as we bring forward the Senior Men's Grass. And uh, we're going to get you gentlemen to come on out here. We'll see if we can, uh, how many groups we need. Maybe it's just a one group. It's a one group. We already know that by the registration. So uh, I like how Rusty thinks. I like how these... Uh, Arena men are working it here tonight, nice and smooth on the uh, transitions, and of course, comfortable, comfortable. All right, here we go. Chinnakee Lake, it's grass dance time. Let's get them dancing. Good luck, gentlemen. <laughs>
about a nice round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. First contest go around. Thank you, Chinnikey Lake. Thunder Lake stand by. Talk about uh, celebrities out here, Nathan. We got a good friend of ours from Poundmaker represent Tony Tusik Tatusis. You know, aside from Pow Wow, tell us a little bit about your hip hop and how that's going. Yeah, it's going good. I just released a single called Res to Ridget. So you can go stream that on Spotify, Apple Music, all that stuff. Uh, I do a lot of audio engineering as well. I record a lot of artists. Uh, I did a couple Pow Wow uh, albums as well, Round Dance albums. Nice. And uh, yeah, lately I've just been, now Pow Wow season's wrapped up, I've just been recording music at home, writing new music every day. I uh, used to perform with uh, your, is that your uncle, Dylan? Oh yeah, that's Dylan? my yeah, that's my cousin, uncle. Yeah. So how how long have you been dancing, Pow? I actually danced every uh, till I was 15 years old. I stopped dancing at about 15, and then I just started again when I was 29. So I've been back on it for about a year and a half now. How are you feeling out there? Great, man. My body's best life choice I ever made. I quit drinking. I quit, you know, uh, everything like that. Living a toxic lifestyle and just you bet. was the best life choice I made for sure. You so know, that's what we were talking about, me and Cal, before. You know, you're coming back into the circle, man. All the good vibes, all the good energy, just coming back. Feeling oh, good yeah. all around, eh? Yeah, man. Body, I'm getting in shape, and you know, I'm mentally, I'm in a better yeah. place as yeah. well. How did it affect your hip hop, uh, your producing, your singing, and things like that? Well, it took the whole summer away from me every year now. I dedicate my summer to Pow Wow Trail, right? Um, that's what I did last year and the year before, this year and the year before. Um, but it affected me in a positive way. You know, I'm gaining more Indigenous followers. I'm representing for Indigenous people more within my music videos, uh, on my platform, through my dancing as well. And uh, yeah, just most importantly, just doing positive, being a positive role model yeah, for the youth. Yeah. Well, Check him out online. Here he is, Tony Tatusis, AKA Too Sick. Thanks for doing this, buddy. Yeah, thank you guys for having me. It's Tony Too Sick on Instagram, Too Sick Too Deadly on uh, TikTok. Thank you guys again. Oh, oh. Yeah. right there thank you thunder lake good song good show senior woman's fancy senior men's fancy come on out to the dance floor here we uh, saw some of these gentlemen earlier in the dance special i'll uh, listen up here uh, we man's judges for the upcoming special he would like to see you uh, behind the announcer stand so if uh, we man approached you to ask him uh, to uh, Help him out with his uh, special. He needs to talk to you ASAP, ASAP alone. Also, uh, junior and senior adults, you don't have to be in Grand Entry tomorrow afternoon. That's totally optional to you, but uh, otherwise we'll see you Saturday night live. So senior and junior adults. In the meantime, it's ready for the contest here. We got the uh, Black Kill singing champions in the house. We're gonna turn it on over here. Bullhorn, anytime you're ready. Sing your men fancy, hook a ha, hook a ha. <laughs>
How about a big round of applause? Uh, senior men's go on over there to the lineup, and uh, we do have a feather on the arena floor. A notorious, uh, I believe, uh, I'm not sure if you realize, but you're... Uh, your feather uh, is good. We're ex excited for the uh, weekend. Excited to see what undone. happens. We're going to ask Mr. Tommy Draper to come on out and uh, look upon this feather here. Uh, chicken style dancer. And then again, uh, following in the footsteps of uh, your dad, Earl Wood, into the MC. How is it going for you? Um, it's been a blessing to have, uh, to have so much uh, support from our dancing to the singing and to, and, uh, to be priming at a young MC, I'm very grateful for all the opportunity that Creators has given, has given me as a young you man. And a lot of people need to remember as, uh, as youth that we need to step in these positions to bring our family and our community to a stronger place. So you enjoying every moment, every step, every chance I get. You know, uh, you know, I totally agree. You know, growing up, a young MC, I never thought I would be an MC, but I had uh, good role models as well, such as yourself. Like, uh, you have great role models out there. One I like to think of is uh, late Gordon Tatusis when I was younger and listening to him. But, you know, stepping into those roles, uh, a lot goes through your mind, you know. And uh, I know you come into your own as an MC. You have your own unique style. But not only powwow, you do some rodeo as well. Yeah, we do some rodeos, do some auctions. I'm an auctioneer, a young auctioneer, and we're really grateful. Yeah. There's so much work to know that you can utilize your voice in such a powerful way, and your voice can change so many things. And so when Creator blesses you with opportunity, you take that opportunity and with love and good energy and just shoot for it. You betcha. Shoot for the stars. You betcha. I look <laughs> forward to working with you. I was telling uh, uh, Chief Moxon's having a rodeo, and uh, I'm, I'm not familiar with rodeo. You are. I've gone into the Indian Relay a bit, but, uh, you know, shout out to Chief Moccasin. Hey, bring us both in. We're going to come as a pair. We want to work together. We want to dab with this auto first nation. Jackson, thanks for doing this. You're awesome. doing a great job. Nice working with you, my man. Thank you, Mr. Jackson Cal. Jackson Action awesome. Jackson. And all you at home, stay safe, stay healthy. Know that you're loved, you're wanted, and you're beautiful. We'll see you very soon on the Power Trail or wherever we see each other. May Creator bless your family and all your loved ones. Aho. Hey, hey, hey. pick up the feather and present it back. My brother Elmer Rattlesnake, uh, one of the uh, premier announcers of Treaty 6 territory, mentioned that uh, whenever we have a feather dropped, we pick it up so that the enemy doesn't know that we're in their territory. This is the reason why in this territory they have this, this pick up ceremony for this uh, champion dancer. Also, renowned YouTuber, TikToker, Mr. James Jones. Yeah, notorious Cree, so we'd like to thank all of the family, friends, and relatives that gave a donation to help them out uh, to give something to the feather pickup. We're going to go to Poundmaker for the one and out. Poundmaker, if you will, please, let's dance out our eagle staffs. Ladies and gentlemen, let's all rise, those that can, as we uh, render our eagle staffs here this evening, and we're going to get right into our junior adult prairie chicken dancers, so be ready. Here we go, the dance out. Let's all rise.
their pound maker for honoring the Eagle Staffs and dancing and retiring them for tonight. Night number one here in Red Deer International Pow Wow. Junior adult dance judges come on in. Marilyn Contois, Lyman Smallboy, Cameron Kutney, Steve Hunt, Leah Amuso Gillette, Brandon Daniels, Warren Daniels, Nathan Mitzwing, Randall Paskeman, Roger Hunt, Claude Friday. Come on in, dance judges. Come on in. We're going to have two groups in our prairie chicken style. So stand by, Blackfoot Confederacy, Dakota Nation. You'll be singing for our junior adult prairie chicken dancers. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the dance of the Sixaga Nation, Blackfoot Confederacy. And this is also still an avid practiced society amongst the Blackfoot Confederacy. Beautiful healing dance that was rendered to those that needed blessing prayers. They would put them at the edge of the dance floor and our prairie chicken dancers would bestow that good energy, good blessings upon those that needed it. We also acknowledge that this is also the, the prairie chicken mating style dance. They're gonna go all out. They're gonna be interpreting their unique mating dance styles, trying to impress upon uh, that wonderful mate out there. So watch their movements, watch the heads, the shoulders, all of these awesome styles of our prairie chicken dancers. We're gonna have two groups here. Group number one, you're gonna be singing, uh, dancing to Blackfoot Confederacy. Group number two, you'll have Nakota Nation rocking the nation for group number two in our junior adult men's prairie chicken. We got a lot of dancers in our junior adults. We got some groups that have three groups in them. So we're gonna be going through back-to-back uh, -back styles. Judges, be on standby. We're gonna go right into our next song once we have the high sign. Our singing contest is done for tonight, so we're just gonna go continue on with our drum order. And uh, we're still in our reverse drum order. We got the high sign for our group number one, Blackfoot Confederacy. Let's get rockin', 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 rockin',
Let's bring it home. to acknowledge our head man dancer rocking this joint, Mr. Cakes and Thompson. We're going to go to group number two. Come on in, group number two. Nakota Nation, you'll be rocking the Red Deer Nation. Once again, we like to acknowledge all of our dance judges for differentiating between the different dance styles. We got the high sign, Nakota Nation. Let's light them up, boys. Let's light them up. <laughs> Junior adult women's traditional standby. Mountain Cree, stand by. Rocking songs, there's some rocking dancing. Light them up, warriors! Come on in, that beautiful, graceful style dating back to the Buffalo days, the oldest dance style of the arsenal of dances amongst our women, junior adult ladies, traditional. We got the awesome rocking buckskin style dress, elk tooth dress, cloth dress out there. We're going to have a couple of groups here, I'm told, so we'll let you know. We'll number you off here. One, stay out there. Two, we'll get you the second song here. Mountain Cree, stand by. On behalf of uh, Wee Man, he said it's 18 and up. Please uh, respect his wishes. It is a memorial men's traditional at the... Uh, end of uh, tonight's uh, session, so uh, 18 and up, men's traditional. Here we go, Mountain Cree in the shadow of the Rocky Mountains. Let's get in the mix out of treaty number six, Mountain Cree.
graceful Styles ladies go and line them on up. Group number two, come on in. While they're coming in here, we have uh, uh, for some of you that are looking to buy uh, a detillion uh, kind of a necklace, uh, we have Russ McLeod from over in this great state of Washington. He's here, and some of you that are on social media, you know uh, Russ Ware is uh, something sought out. And uh, he's the traditional dancer over there at the uh, section WW. And uh, he's that cool traditional dancer in the blue, Russ Ware. And uh, you can go and barter with him, but it starts about $600 for the Detillion Shell necklace. And those are one of a kind, so go and check them out. Pipe Stem Creek, let's get rocking. Group number two, Junior Adult Ladies Traditional. Judges, stationary styles out there, walk around.
Goose bumps deadly. Line them up, ladies. Line them up. Thank you there, Pipe Stem Creek. Once again, we'd like to uh, acknowledge our head lady dancer, Chelsea Bull, reminding all of our beautiful woman's traditional of her special. That'll be going on Sunday afternoon on Sunday Showdown. We'll see you all there for that head woman dancer, Chelsea Bull, woman's traditional special. Thank you, Chelsea. Rocking the joint with that awesome style that uh, you've danced the powwow trail all your life with. We're gonna call upon our traditional dancers, warriors in our adult, senior, junior adult categories. Cricket Federation standby. Kehiwan as Sydney. Be ready for uh, group number two. Group number one, Cree Confederation. Let's rock the nation. Gathering of nations, singing champions. finer than a knit comb. Come on in, group number two. Come on in. We're going to go to the rocking sounds of Kehio Asini. Kehio Asini. Stand by, Eagle Rock. We're going to go to group number two. As soon as we get the high sign from our arena director, we got it. Let's get rocking, 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 rocking.
Women's jingle, stand by. Touch them, rock and styles, warrior. On here, guys. Uh, I got Jacob like Faithful here, lead singer for the Young standby. Spirit Singers. How We're you doing? Go to the first what about that medallion, though? I had to Some switch it up. I had to. I'm a Calgary <laughs> Flame. My my family's yeah. all Edmonton Oilers, so I'm right, only, but it's Cal. Cal. My <laughs> second <laughs> name is Gary, <laughs> the Calgary <laughs> Kid. The oh man, I'm gonna wear my Oilers oh, my jersey round. tomorrow, and then uh, I have nothing well. to say about the Oilers. They're the only team in Treaty Six territory, so we all gotta support them. <laughs> hey, you know what? I want to have a little conversation about your your singing group, Young Spirit. Uh, you know, we were talking uh, a bit earlier here, and uh, I guess your guys' rise to um, the world class singers that you are from. Mm. Like, when did you guys start? Well, we started in 2002 in Sampson, Alberta. Okay. And um, just a group of guys that wanted to try sing together on a new drum and just sing. We're basically a cover band back then and just started kicking out some songs that we knew and I just kind of stuck. So, kind of coming to your own now, the singers that you are, like people want you at their pals. You guys won some awards, some Grammys. Tell us a little bit about that. Well, it's it kind of comes with the territory. Like when you've put in a lot of hard work over the summers and representing our indigenous people the way we have, you know, you get notoriety and a lot of people appreciate what you've done and how you're, tr you know, con continuing to you know, inspire our youth to pick up traditional music and practices. And I guess it just comes with the, the, the territory, right? Yeah. And as far as like awards and whatnot, it's just a reflection of our passion for music and making music, right? Composing music. And to be acknowledged for something that we're passionate about, it's just, it's just, um, you know, it's kind of, there's no words for it. It's, it's sort of what we grew up hearing and grew up learning and for someone to give you an award for something that we do all weekend on ceremony and whatever, it's just mind blowing. Love Pretty it. Cool. You know, talk to us a little bit. Uh, we we're talking about the, the entrepreneurial part of uh, entrepreneurial part of your your drum group, uh, Young Spirit. Yeah, yeah. Um, I guess it kind of started just just before COVID. Um, I came from a sales background. I used to work for. Uh, 
uh, manufacturing plant out in Saskatchewan. And then I just, you know, I tried my bit at sales and had some success. And then when I came home, uh, well, I made my home in Lethbridge, Alberta with my, my fiance now. She was my girlfriend at the okay. time. Um, we just basically, yeah, thank you. We basically, I, I said, hey, I want to try sales. You know, I want to try and see if I can make a business out of um, something, right? So then when it came down to names, I, I, I chose to use the drum group name because it had recognition in communities and people knew who we were. And so you guys have a lot of swag going on, one of your yeah, products right Yeah, here. so it, it, it went from selling janitorial chemical cleaning supplies to manufacturing surgical face masks to selling water treatment plant chemicals, to um, making merchandise and doing our own merch, and uh, everything from that to being a venture capitalist and in, uh, you know investing in small business venture. everywhere. And taking care of yourselves and making yeah, it easier on the boys. Yeah, boys yeah. well, the all the guys here, they're pretty spoiled. They don't have to worry about nothing going to Pao. <laughs> Hey, big role model out there for us, uh, world-class singers, uh, young spirit singers. Thank you for doing this, Jacob. Right on, bro. Hey, 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 yeah. Hey. Yeah. Us. yeah. <laughs> be a strong provider, not a free rider, to rock this joint with one of our beautiful America's original beauties. All right, line them up. Group number two, make your way out there. Buffalo Robe, stand by. Come on in, ladies. We got the original style. We got the contemporary style out there. Thank you, dance judges, for differentiating between those different dance styles. Once again, every once in a while, close your eyes, hear the rain, and think of our loved ones in need prayers. Buffalo robe. Let's rock this joint.
Sir Power Fans Rock in this joint. Group number two. Group number three. Let's circle up, ladies. Bad Wart Cloud, you'll have this group. We'll ask our grass dancers to be ready. Grass dance. Fancy lady style, men's fancy. And then the qualifying round for the men's traditional late Floyd Bear Spa special. Here we go. Light them up, boys. Light them up. Bad War Cloud. Ask our warriors in the grass dance style to come on in. Lazy dog, be ready. You know, brother Donnie, I did the ultimate secret gig a couple of weeks ago. We took a crew over to Ottawa and performed in front of the Prime Minister of Canada, Justin Trudeau. And when this dance came out, you know, the grass dance, I interpreted it was about the Omaha, everything they do on one foot, they do on the other. Transferred to the Sioux, brought up here. But let's acknowledge the Prime Minister of Canada for legalizing the grass dance. So <laughs> man, oh man, he loved it. He loved the joke. Eh? But I just about told him, quit trying to act indigenous, breaking up with your woman during powwow season. Uh, yeah. All right, we're going to have two groups, three groups. We're gonna have three groups here. Group number one, we're gonna go to Lazy Dog. Group number two, Black Stone. Group number three, Southern Medicine. All right, group number two, stand out there. The Grass Stats. Circle up, Warrior, circle up. Dance judges, thank you for helping us out once again. Lazy dog. Let's. Oh, young spirit. Let's get rocking. Ah! <laughs> 
dose bombs deadly. Thank you there, young spirit. Thank you there, group number one in our junior adult men's grass dance style. Group number two, come on in, lazy dog, stand by. Blackstone, you'll be singing for group number three in our grass dancers style. So be ready, ladies fancy. Hukka, we got the high sign. Lazy dog, let's turn them on, turn them up, turn them loose. healing energy emanating from their dance persona. All right, thank you there, lazy dog rockin' song. Hey, we got another lost little child here. Let's lift up the little one up here. Let's put her on the, put him on the uh, TV here. We have our cameraman give us another shot of this little one up here. I don't know what's going on, uh, hell. There's, this little baby has no shoes on. They found him out in a parking lot, and he was standing there. He was holding $5,000, and uh, <laughs> he's got no shoes on, Hal. Somebody, if they know this baby. We'd like to remind all of our parents, because uh, they're still a few days away from child tax day, doesn't mean uh, you need to neglect them. All right, uh, Rusty, what do you say? Blackstone, let's light them up, boys, let's light them up. Group number three. <laughs>
song there, Blackstone, to some rock and dance in group number three, Junior Men's Grass. Let's bring in our ladies, fancy style. We got the original and we got the contempt style. We're going to have three groups in this, three groups. So Southern Medicine, Soul Rider, Crazy Creek, be ready. Once again, our uh, head drum boss. Mr. Steve Wood, acknowledging all the drums here, getting them some good singing opportunities for contests, but also excusing them as they uh, progress around the end of the night here. With the exception of our drums that are going to be sticking around for, <laughs> for our uh, qualifying round, for Eric's special, you are excused after you sing. 12.45, drum roll call, 1 o'clock, grand entry. We got the high sign. Let's get it rocking. Southern Medicine.
cha 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 Line them up, group number one. Rockin' song, Southern Medicine. Soul Riders, stand by for group number two. As soon as with the high sign, we're gonna get rockin'. Come on in, ladies, in group number two. Soul Rider, let's rock this. Join, 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 join. song to some rock and dancing. Thank you. Group number two. Group number three, make your way out there. Situate yourself around the circumference of the circle in the perpendicular position to create equilibrium. Come on in, ladies. Circle up. We're going to go to the sounds of Crazy Creek. This is with the high sign. And we got it. Crazy Creek, let's light them up, boys. Let's light them up. Thank you there, Crazy Creek rocking this joint. Fancy Feather Dancers, situate yourself out there. Fancy Feather Dancers. You know, tomorrow's gonna be a, a ring of fire eclipse. So we like to remind everyone not to look directly at the sun. It's gonna be visible starting around 9 a.m. at its height. Should be a ring of fire towards 11 a.m. So. Don't look directly at the sun tomorrow, even if you have uh, shades on. Just a little pearls of wisdom and caution that we will have an eclipse tomorrow. 
All right, this is group number one. We got the high sign. Let's rock this joint to Chinookie Lake. Chinookie Lake, rocking song. Thunder Lake, stand by. We're going to go to you right away. This is with the high sign. Group number two. Come on in, warriors. Come on in. All of our adults and golden age buckskin, you're not required to come in for a grand entry at 1 o'clock. You'll be doing it all Saturday night live tomorrow evening. So take a long break. Enjoy your morning and enjoy your afternoon. Enjoy the sights of Red Deer, Alberta. Go and check out the brand new First Nation owned and operated Ochis Casino that had just opened recently. Here we go. Group number two, Thunder Lake. Light them up. Chum rocking styles. Thank you there, Thunder Lake. All right, we're going to go on over to our two uh, drums that were selected for the qualifying round of this uh, fine young warrior, Eric Ear. Qualifying round for the men's traditional in honor of his late father, Floyd Bearspra. And we're going to ask Mr. Action Jackson Tahuka to guide us through this qualifying round and the drums involved. 
Hey, no reason. All right, here we're gonna call upon our judges for the Eric Bears Ball special on behalf of the late. Floyd Bears Paw, we're gonna ask all of our judges to be getting ready. All of our men's traditional dancers be on standby. This special is in honor of the late Floyd Bears Paw. And on behalf of the family, they would like to invite all the 18 years and older men's traditional special right here for two groups. We're gonna have two groups. So Hey, Rusty, I'm going to go on down there real quick. We're going to go on down with this awesome special on behalf of the Bears Paw family as we go through this. We want to let you know we're going to have two groups. We got a lot of songs to go through to get to our top 20 right here. So the top 20 out of this next round, the first round, will go on to the next tomorrow. Wapa So all you drummers, who I believe we have Creek Confederation, Blackstone, you are the two that were chosen. All other groups are now excused at this time. We've already taken out our retirement of our Eagle staff and our flag carriers. We are good to go on to the next. All of you men's traditional, come on out here. As you can tell, we've had a long, wonderful day of powwow. Good contest dancing all the way through. And I can tell you right now, we are on the next big thing, which is going to be our men's traditional. All right there, gentlemen. All right there, warriors. This is how it's going to go. We're going to let you know this is a memorial special, but on behalf of the family, I would like to link all of you gentlemen here. As the family says, tomorrow we're going to be having our memorial songs, our memorial honoring of the late Floyd Bears Paw. We're going to have two groups. You will dance two songs, try to make the top 10. At the second group, we'll choose another 10. That will be our top 20 for the special tomorrow. And as we go on through, we want to let you know you got Greek Confederation. We have Blackstone, and we are vowing tomorrow for our memorial songs, for our memorial walk in the way of the old people. We like to invite all of our warriors at this time to bring your heart, to bring your good energy, and to bring your power, to bring the powers to dance and knock down the towers as we go on here to the family special of the Bear Paw family. We welcome all of our men's traditional. Group number one, you got Creek Confederation, son. Group number one, second song, Black Stone, as we are ready to own this floor tonight. Once I get the high sign from the family, You can't bring Claude Friday anywhere, this guy. You bring a guy with the last name Friday, that's what all he's going to do is joke, man, on a Friday night. Okay, gentlemen, this is about time. This is about when we're ready to go. If you're at home and you're on the intercom, we're sending our love and good energy as we're going to a memorial special on behalf of Floyd Baseball. We're going to go to group number one. Group number one, you're on the arena floor. We got the high sign from our arena director. We have the high sign from our family. All of our judges, please come to the arena. All of our judges. 
outside of the dancers. So we're going to have all of our judges stand on the outside of the dancers as we're ready to do two songs. Gentlemen, two songs. Top ten. Are you ready? Hey, how you doing, Red Deer? Are you ready to see a men's traditional special right here, right now? Here we go. Friday Night Lights. We're ready to hit the road on the show. Take it away. Nigga, my boy, suck. Cree. Confederation! Nigga, my boy, suck. some noise let's make some noise for that first song in the men's traditional special right on creek confederation thank you very much let's get your dancers some water as we're moving on down to the next song coming to blackstone singers right on there gentlemen as you feel the power as you feel that good spirit you know this family's been dealing with a lot trying to move forward you know, the loss of a loved one has been very hard. As tomorrow we vow to uh, dance our memorial, to dance our memorial walk, to, uh, to push that, that good spirit into the family's hearts, into their minds, into their area and their travels and their trails that they go forth. We want to thank you to the family that put on this special, the Bear's Paw family, as they worked hard to bring together the people. And that's the way of the old people here. As we come together to celebrate, gentlemen, you know, as this young man, Eric Bearspaw, we all know him as We Death. 
also known as AKA Chief Little Foot in the micro wrestling world. This guy is a professional. And I can tell you one thing, a lot of people have come across his path and has treated him really good, but also has treated him in a way that a lot of us pray for. And I'm gonna tell you, these gentlemen right here are dancing for you and the family. Let's go with the second song, coming to you from Blackstone, nigga, my voice up. spectators as we go to the top 10 being chosen right here gentlemen gentlemen we want you to face <laughs> we want you to face that way whatever way you choose I'm just kidding no we want you to uh, stand where you are get your places as we're gonna have our family and our relatives to come choose the top 10 dancers, if you're chosen, come stand in front here where I am out in the front. Come on over here, top 10 judges, pick your dancers. Congratulations if you make the top 10. Group number two, stand on by group number two. Oh, oh man, I don't know. I see a lot of good energy coming out of these dancers right here. All the love for the boys, all the love for our warriors, our modern day warriors as they come here to give a good dance to our people. Welcome, welcome to our top 10 chosen out of the first group. Right on, right on. Right on there, gentlemen. We're pushing forward, we're pushing forward. We got how many? Tamego. Six so far, we have six dancers being chosen at this time. We're gonna push on over to the next three dancers as we move forward. We want to encourage all of you dancers that are out here that did not make our top 10 if you're not chosen. We're sending you our love, our good energy and know that this family has tried hard to put this special on in a way to bring good memories for the people. Oh man, oh man, Claude Friday, this guy, oh this guy, oh, if you don't know who Claude Friday is, I tell you. All right, gentlemen, come on over here. If you didn't make top 10, we appreciate you. Let's shake hands and encourage all your other traditional dancing brothers, I should say. 
brothers from other mothers. You know what's good as we're brown, we're down for the town. We got mush and ready to hunt some moose. Get ready for the loose. That's how we do it. Oh, we are right on, boys. Right on, boys. Sec. <laughs> <laughs> All of a sudden, uh, you get you get the moose calls going, and then Cloud Friday gets nice and excited. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All of a sudden, his heart is screaming elk meat. Creek and Feds, you have the first song. <clears throat> Grape two, here we go. <clears throat> Group two, here we go. We're on the floor. We're going over here to Cree Confederation. When you're ready, nigga, my boy, suck, you're on the air. Hee <laughs>
song in that group number two group number two that was a wicked first song creek confederation you are now excused creek confederation we thank you from the bottom of our hearts we'll see you back here Wapa again you know from drum roll call for 12 45 we'll see you back here get yourself some water get yourself some real estate as we are going on to the next great thing our men's traditional special on behalf of the late Floyd Bears Paw. We have all of our relatives here watching. They're learning, they're spectating, they're, they're pushing forward in a way that you don't understand. As people, when you lose someone that you love, you have to learn how to move forward. To keep trying, to keep going. And so the family put on this special so that they can keep going forward and that they can move forward with love and good energy and send their relative that way of life through the song, through the dance, and through the power of the feet as we rumble the ground of the buffalo and the thunder. We go over here to the sounds of Blackstone. Here we go. story let's fill your wicked warrior spirit right here charge the enemy boys charge that enemy pick up your fallen brother he hop In the second group for the late memorials, men's traditional special on behalf of late Floyd Bears Pa. We are now going to be going to the top 10 of the second group. The top 10, if you're chosen, come stand over here in front as you all have made it to tomorrow, the second round of this special. You know, the family put on a lot of money, a lot of good energy for this. It's not about the money, it's about the, about the good energy, and the family wants you to remember that your spirit dances here for a good reason and they need the reason is to move forward with their family with their loved ones as you uh, as i stand here with my relatives and my family my kinfolk they want to thank you to all the dancers here that came out and danced the ones that did not make it they send you their love their good energy and their prayers as they move forward in life their beauty the beauty of your dance and the beauty of your power feels good for our people I was wondering who that was. I don't know. Claude just chose as anybody. Oh, yeah. Just kidding. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Right on. Congratulations. How many do you have? Tamego. Right on. How many we have? Their arena directors. George Rusty. Oh. 
10, I say. Okay, we have our 10 dancers, I say. Come on over here, gentlemen. Shake hands, and we want to thank you once again for coming out to this special and dancing your heart out to a top 20. We'll see you back here tomorrow. As you danced hard for the family, we thank you once again. Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, we are going to let everyone know this is the last part of our agenda. From our arena directors, I'll we'll see you back here tomorrow. Wapake at 1 o'clock for Grand Entry. All right, you guys, there you go. Uh, that's it for day number one here in uh, Red Deer, the third annual Pow Wow, or the Pow Wow Times International Pow here in Red Deer. Uh, that's it, that's it. Moistas. Uh, I'm tired. I want to go to bed, and I'm going to let Cal and my bro here finish it off. All you people from Red Deer, come out and check out some Pow Wow. There's a big trade fair out here. There's some world-class singing, some world-class dancing. We love bringing it to you online and uh, on, on cable, but it's not the same unless you come down here and say hello. Yeah. Come and check it out. Red Deer, right on. Day two tomorrow. We'll see you. One o'clock grand entry. But we're going to be on live here about 12.30. Yes. Bringing you all the action. So long. See you in the morning. Wapagi. Moistas and wapagi.